Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Today I will show you how to increase your privacy and security in the Google Chrome web browser. In Chrome, go to the top right and click on the three dotted menu. Scroll down to settings, click on that. Now we are in the settings page of Google Chrome. By default it opens to you and Google. The first section we're going to look at here is called Sync and Google Services. Click on that. Scroll down. And you'll see Help Improve Chrome's Features and Performance. I'll make sure this is turned off. This automatically sends usage statistics and crash reports to Google Chrome. Now obviously if you are not worried about sending that to Google Chrome, to Google, then leave this on, but I'll make sure this is turned off. Next a header we're going to look at on the left is called Safety Check. Google Chrome has a built-in safety check which can help you keep you safe from data breaches, bad extensions and more. I like to periodically run a safety check and all you do is check now. This checks your computer for that your Google Chrome is updated, which is very important if you're worried about security and privacy, that no passwords are compromised, that your safe browsing is on, standard protection is on, and you have no harmful extensions. And if it does find any uh, bad extensions, I recommend you uninstall those or remove them as soon as possible. Next header we're going to look at is privacy and security. Another thing I like to do periodically is clear my browsing data. Click on that. Here you can see we have your browsing history, which clears all your history and sites you have visited. Cookies and other site data, which will um, delete... All the, all the cookies from the, the websites that have left cookies on your computer. And obviously, just be aware if you clean this that you will have to sign back into uh, web pages that require a password. And then the last one is cached images and files. Now, what I'm going to do for this exercise is I'm going to uncheck these two because I, have a, I, I don't want to clear that now, but I recommend periodically leave those two checked. And then you go clear data. Now that it's cleared my browsing data. The next uh, header we're going to look at under privacy and security is cookies and other sites data. Scroll down. Here you'll see by default Windows blocks third party cookies in incognito. What we're going to do is we're going to say block third party cookies, which means it will block them all the time. That means any sites that are not from Google will basically be blocked. And that increases your privacy there. Let's just go back. Next one we're going to look at is security under privacy and security. And I'm going to scroll down here to help improve security on the web for everyone. Sends URLs of some pages you visit, limited system information, blah, 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 to Google. I'll make sure this is off. Now, obviously, if you are not worried about that, you can leave this on, but I'll make sure this setting is turned off. I think we are done under privacy and security. Yes, we are. Okay, the next thing is on the left. Go down to, oh, one more thing in privacy and security under site settings. Scroll down. Yeah, you will see. Make sure flash. Block sites from running Flash. I know Google, uh, uh, Google Chrome blocks them by default, but just check. Sometimes some some older sites like to turn this on. So make sure that Flash is blocked. Block sites from running Flash in the settings. It is off. Okay. Now we're going to go to Advanced. And then... What I like to do over here is in extensions, periodically I like to go through my extensions. Obviously, if you've run the safety check, it will it checks your extensions. But if there's any extensions that you, when you go through your extensions that you have not downloaded from reputable sources, then I strongly recommend that you remove those extensions from Google Chrome as that could be a security and privacy risk. X out of that. And then the last one is about Chrome on the bottom. And for this, it, it checks Google Chrome that Google Chrome is running the latest version. 
once again in your safety check that we did previously it will automatically check but you can also check down here by about Chrome and running the most recent version of, of uh, Google Chrome is most probably the most important aspect of your privacy and security uh, with Google Chrome. Anyway that is my way of of updating and um, increasing my privacy and security in Google Chrome. I hope you found this video useful and once again thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.